Shut up. You know, we've been here a long time. You think you're ever gonna talk to me? You got my file. Read it. I read it. It's full of facts, not feelings. I'd much rather talk to you than read about you. I'm too tired. You know, I'm kind of tired myself. How about we just end today a little bit early and start again tomorrow morning? Okay. Okay. I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah, nowhere to go? What? I don't know. You seem lonely sitting here by yourself, so I figured you had nowhere to go for the weekend. Fish is one of the lucky ones. He always has places to go on the weekends. It's, it's hard at first, you know, adjusting and everything, but trust me, it'll be fine. You know, you kind of look all mixed up. Like, like you have a little bit of everything in you. Your name fits you. America. In America, I'm in America, and America is me. And we live in Michigan, in America. I'm America. Hot dog. Yes, you are. Yes, yes. America <laughs> is a place where we live, and it's also your name. <laughs> I'm in America, and America is me. Oh, watch out. Oh, how about I'm that? in America. And America is me. You know, I think my mom slept with almost every guy in America. Now she started on Mexico. <laughs> She's a flake, but... You want some? No, thanks. Food here is pretty good. It's not that bad. I mean, there's, like, vending machines everywhere, and they always film every Friday, so... So, America, I know you don't want to talk about it, but three months ago you tried to kill yourself. Why? Why don't you read my file? Why don't you read your file? So interested in what it says? I don't need to read it. I already know what's there. <laughs> look at you. Look at you, boy. No, you a man now. You a man now. <laughs> You want to talk about Mrs. Harper? No. You lived with her and her brother, Reggie, right? Why are you asking me what you already know? I don't know everything. I know you were taken from your mom when you were just a baby. Nobody took me. Listen. I know this is hard stuff. This is painful stuff to talk about. To remember, to feel. 
you were taken from your mom by CPS, Child Protective Services. They did it to keep you safe, America. You were placed with a foster family? They were rich, and my skin was too dark, so they gave me to their housekeeper. Mrs. Harper? Yeah, Miss Harper. And she tried to adopt you, hmm? You think about her a lot? Yeah, I think about her. I think about a lot of things. Like what? Like you wouldn't understand. Well, maybe I would. To try me. Well, listen. That's a good work today. Really. Nice job. I'm gonna let you out early. Leave me alone, okay? I'm fine. Are you mad at me? <sighs> no, I'm not mad at you, okay? Just leave me alone, all right? I'm fine. Go back to sleep. I'm fine. Leave me alone. We've got books. And there's some good books, and there's books here for everyone. So I want everybody to come on up and take your pick. Come on, come on up. Take your pick. OK, now, some of the books were donated, but some of them are mine. So respect, please. Lemony Snicket's A Series of Unfortunate Events. You should like that, Marshall. That one's pretty dark. OK, now, just remember that you have to give a little report on the book that you choose to the class. So choose wisely. This one got pictures. Oh, that's good. That's a good one for you. Now, here's a popular book. It's called The Catcher in the Rye. I read it. Did you like it? It's a good book. You should read it. So what's going on? How long do I have to stay here? Depends. How long is long? A week? A month? A year? What? Long as whenever they feel like deciding. And who is they? Everybody. The state. You. Long is long. 